your girl pretty much had three jobs. If we keeping it all the way 100. She ready y'all, new year, new me, it's spring. We need to stop. She's ordering new business cards. She's getting new Patreon brochures. We are ordering more greeting cards, more sleeves. She's revamping her whole life, okay? Anytime I get anything printed, it's on Canva because they're for real. And they're quick and you can pick up in person. You can pick it up from FedEx, Kinko's, wherever you at. Or they can also deliver it. I'm having to deliver it because I'll be forgetting it. Hence like one of them vlogs. Now I'm shifting my energy. <sighs> I forget. Let me call them. I keep forgetting to pick this shit up. It was up there for weeks. I'm just so grateful when customers give me grace. I be like, babe, let me show you this text that she said. Like, I'm about to revamp my whole shit. I'm getting a business card. I got events coming up. I got, actually, a lot of my stuff should come today. I am so excited. The packages from Canva have arrived. Hey, good looking. Okay. <laughs> you know what it is. No. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Look at them planting trees. They say by printing this design, you have planted a tree. Your efforts will contribute to the restoration of land with millions of trees being planted across over 4,000 hectares around the world. Presented by the Gamma team. Wow. Hector, so that's bigger than an acre, huh? That's a Hector. Okay. <laughs> that's a Hector. Okay. Ooh, it's giving. It's giving crispy. It's giving crispy. <laughs> this photo of me looks crazy. I didn't even realize it. It'll do. It'll do. I changed the back. For the most part, the inside is the same. It's love out here, y'all. It's just, it's love. Let me have a real straight up chat with y'all. <laughs> when I say I have been avoiding the true work that I need to do for my art and my career and everything, that is such an understatement. I feel like I've just been running from the person that I know that I can be and now I'm living in the full embodiment and it feels good. It also feels like... Oh Lord. We dropping off the things for Kelly. Kelly, if you are watching this, like, thank you again. Okay. We got it all wrapped and packaged. Mm. This is like the best part about having local local uh, customers because it's like you can just hand deliver stuff <laughs> if it if the if the situation didn't work out so we just we make a drop off today she need her snacks <laughs> I gotta treat myself treat yourself every now and again because I was not in the mood but she did her work look at her productivity see you gotta romanticize you just gotta romanticize this life give yourself a little treat a little something something we going to Trader Joe's. <laughs> Trader Joe's. <laughs> She's a basic bitch. Is that your? Is that is that your reward? <laughs> Trader Joe's. Simple basic. Bitch. She got her snacks. Of course. Classic. What do they put in these? I think they there must be some addictive substance. Maybe it's the paprika. <laughs> Delicious. I love, if y'all haven't tried the dehydrated oak grill, like, are we for real having Trader Joe's hauls in the car? Yes, we are. And spaghetti sauce, because it's about to be, it's gonna be a pasta night. A pasta night, okay? Y'all, growing up as a kid, I did not like spaghetti. It's partly because my mom made it all the time. But as an adult, oh, I get it. <laughs> I get it. You throw them noodles in that water, heat up that sauce, so you ready, okay? When in doubt, it's a spaghetti night. All the same to me, plain Jane spaghetti. It's a spaghetti night. 
And then college time, it was ramen. Okay, like, shout, shout out to the pasta. Shout out to the noodle. Been saving lives. <laughs> to see this oh my god <laughs> we love all of the quiet place places okay all the quiet places we love them all i can't wait babe i was telling about the quiet place you see lupita mm -hmm. ah it's gonna be epic it's gonna be epic my point yeah you ready come on you want me to hold something Is nope. that came in yesterday from Amazon Canva, all the things. It is such a sunny day. Like, can we just acknowledge that it is officially warming up? Okay. Um, I do have a customer coming today to pick up some prints, which I'm really excited about. Your girl pretty much had three jobs, okay? If we keeping it all the way 100, Um, so pretty much left my job she back she back on her grind okay she's back to her full-time artistry the truth is I had never left okay I pretty much had like three jobs which was the part-time job as a studio assistant editing these videos and still running my art business so yeah I was saying like okay it was kind of it was get to be a lot but throughout these vlogs I think I've been sharing some of the different insights that I've been having but um yeah, getting this stuff together for a customer that's coming later today. Y'all, we on some straight. Making it scrappy, okay? Because I didn't have these big um, plastic sleeves in the studio, I don't have the back, the backing for them either. And since these are so big, I didn't want it to be like wobbly and loose. I'm looking at back cards. It's like $5 for just like a mat board that's this size. And I'm like, I just know people just go trash it like they gonna take the print out put it in a frame and trash all this other stuff so yeah 
she just like, I pretty much used a mailer. If y'all can see, y'all can probably really see it. But pretty much what I did was like taped together two um, shipping mailers that I had. Because yeah, like <laughs> part of the process of just even sharing my art with the world and making like turning turn it into a business. It is about thinking about some of those business costs. And it's like, yeah, we're not about to just throw $5 in the trash. <laughs> Am I just sun shining in clouds in the sky? Yeah, everything is right. Imagine stars lighting up the night and the shooting stars so vibrant. You have to make a wish. Nothing's ever The girls came to play, they didn't come to play. Nothing's ever in your way. Scoring every shot you make. No, you've never heard of pain. Because you are just high on life. Every day is Saturday. Life is sweet as birthday cake. Why can't it just stay this way? I don't have any info in the back, so we gotta put business cards, maybe the Patreon brochures. Yeah, we gotta put all that in the back. Is it giving yellow hue? It's giving more, it's giving more accurate a color depiction. Okay, not me cutting, that don't matter. You love to go on a good tangent. Okay, my dear customer just left. He got all the things, okay? All the all the things and he's doing uh, incredible things down in Tacoma, which is so exciting and inspiring. that I had got from Canva. I made new Patreon brochures that's gonna go to folks. Like whenever I pack an order or uh, at events, I like to give these out. Of course, if you are watching this and wanna support what I'm doing, I would love for you to become a patron and that would be absolutely incredible. Um, I found that I've actually been able to grow my Patreon more um, at in-person events, which has just been so beautiful. So yeah, if there are any artists out there and like maybe you don't have a YouTube channel, there's a lot of people out in the world who um, love seeing artists and supporting artists. And so it's it's crazy to think that actually some of my most recent patrons like don't even know that I have a YouTube channel. <laughs> and it's like, it's like this little, like a, yeah, it feels like a whole nother life that I kind of have over here on YouTube. But um, yeah, so I made those on Canva. I didn't get a lot because I just wanted to print it out to make sure it looked okay. Oh, this is cute. Oh, these need to be thicker. They're feeling thin. It's given thin. It's not terrible, but they could be better. It's clean. It's simple. Pause it and scan it. Scan the link. <laughs> Where to find me? That's cute. Love this piece. But I got a new uh, set of business cards. Y'all, why are these so thin? Like the disrespect <laughs> of how thin these business cards are. And maybe, you know what's crazy? I've always gotten, I've always gotten this paper thickness of business card, but I think, I think it's a personal upgrade within myself where I'm just like, <laughs> Oh Lord. We don't like them thin ass, <laughs> now she bougie, okay? Now she bad and bougie. Y'all, I'm just ready. You know, I think I'm ready. I've just gotten over a lot of my internal chatter that now it just, it feels really good to be able to move in a space of self-confidence, self-love, and self-worth. And that's what, that's really what I felt like I was missing. You know, like you get to a point on your like your, your healing journey, your self-development journey, your journey of growth, and you hit a point of bedrock and you realize like, oh, like these are like childhood traumas. <laughs> like, like this is a whole nother, this is a whole nother level that doesn't even have to do with the actual art that I'm creating or the actual, you know, museums that I'm in or the galleries that I'm in or collectors that I have. Like this goes to a deeper level of, 
of fears that I have been processing here with y'all and and I'm, I'm grateful for these tools and these platforms and for y'all comments like just know like <sighs> words of affirmation is genuinely one of my love languages and so when I read y'all comments I genuinely feel a joy in my soul and a connection to y'all that like only other YouTuber and sort of content creators can know and so yeah like just know I read y'all comments and it just it just lights up my life to know that we're able to build a bridge in this like digital world and like we build in this this community over here and so processing with y'all has genuinely helped me in my real life to figure out where I where I want to go and what I'm doing and yeah it's it's going big it's going all the way it's really like it's so crazy even working for this artist i've learned so much and what I, the the crazy thing y'all like the crazy thing about a lot of this is that it genuinely starts with belief in yourself like as cheesy as it sounds as cliche as it sounds as whatever a lot of people are in the positions that they are is because they genuinely had the ultimate level of belief and confidence and faith in themselves that they are going to be who they say that they're going to be and they walk in accordance with it like this that's genuinely that's that's genuinely what it is that's genuinely what it is that's genuinely what it's been for me and like how i've even gotten here and so i realized that i had to channel that same energy to move to the next phase of myself but I sort of hit hit a point where I was like, ooh, I couldn't, I can't operate in the same way. Like there's something else that's holding me back. And that's when I start to uncover the feelings of guilt and shame and unworthiness and fear of success and self-sabotage, like and all the things that I've been processing here. And now I'm like, yeah, girl, like it's game time. Like, let's go. Let's go.